cool with y'all, bro. You see the title of the video. This, this, this really my bread and butter. Now I love my basketball. I love my basketball, but the hoodie collection. I mean, it's it's it tell it all. It tell it all, bro. Top ten visually amazing fights in anime. I'm not even like again. I'll say this a lot. I'm not finna waste too much time because I'm trying to see. I'm trying to see what this list looking like. I ain't gonna lie. I'm trying. I'm, I'm trying to guess a couple of them that they go have on there. You know what I'm saying? They gotta have something from. I don't know. The my hero fights be kind of short, but they do be they do be crazy. So fate clearly clearly fate was gonna land a spot on here. If I'm if I'm not mistaken, Heaven's Field three might land a spot on here. Uh, who else? Uh, Dragon Ball Dragon Ball Super. It's either the Ultra Instinct Goku or, Ultra, or or the Broly the movie. I mean the budget the movie yeah the movie the budget yeah yeah. I mean, I mean, we gonna see, we gonna see, we gonna find out. I mean, we finna get right into this video. Before we start, if you like the video, like, you know what I'm saying? Comment if you wanna, if you want me to watch any other ones. I'm really just finna get right into this, man. Share the video, it's the only way I'ma grow. It's the only way, if you, look, if you like me, if you mess with me, you know what I'm saying, share me. <laughs> we finna get right into this, bro. I ain't even finna waste too much time, bro. If it's it. mm. Already, it's already been. Mmm, yeah, fate, fate is on the tip. Oh my goodness. Mm. Sakuga. Now, what is this Sakuga that I'm talking about? Technically Fire. speaking, it basically Jujutsu means Kaisen. animation. Yes, yes. That's very mundane, right? The whole but show, of course, really. that's not how we use it. And for the anime fan, Sakuga right. means Dragon impressive animation. And I mean impressive mm. animation what is that? I don't that know can what be that considered is. A visual miracle. A recent example would be the most iconic scene in Demon Sucker Slayer. For animation, you know, the bro. one that blew up the internet. Just so we can get it out of the way, Sakuga, in its colloquial term, refers what to is a this show? Or even now a I've seen this. The animation quality just elevates in quality. I've seen that. I've seen that fight. That fight is crazy. Driving the fan base. Nuts. I need to watch that so show. Today, this show. Every show on this list. Shoot. Anime with the most breathtaking animation. However, I won't just be ranking them based on animation, but mm -hmm. also on scale and stakes, mm -hmm. or just plain emotional Makes investment sense. for me. Makes but sense. before that, click the subscribe button, ring the bell, and let's get going. Let's show. Mob Psycho, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this show is crazy. If you ain't watched this show, what are you doing? No, I'm just playing. This show is fire. This show is fire. Throughout the entire show, it's like, what, 24 episodes? Might as well watch it. If you've been an anime fan for five years or so, you would have heard about Mob Psycho and how it has such amazing animation. Yeah. To the point where and there was actual drama artwork. when the show Real didn't win artwork. some online polls for the best animation and the like. That's mm. wild, if you ask me. To be fair, the angry mob... No pun intended, did have a point. Exhibit A, Go on. Mob versus Mogami. One could argue that Mob Psycho is pretty much a chain this of fights a, filled with breathtaking animation. But I think S this rank. one stands out Shout as out it happens early Cleed. in the second season rank. and sets expectations for the rest of the series. Mm. Expectations that were easily met by the Beautiful. godly anime staff. This ain't One Punch Man with a cursed season two, folks. Nah, it's a pivotal real. moment this in Mob's Punch character Man. development and a breathtaking display of Japanese animation prowess. I can't be the only one who got chills when Mob breaks through Mogami after recapturing his color resolve. Scheme, dog. Now that I've shown you this treat for your eyes, oh my perhaps God. you want to try jumping into the Mob Psycho train too. Nah, you you gotta, you gotta watch this show, bro. You like, you like anime, you have to watch this show. And I love anime, so I'll have to hop on this real quick. Mm, that's my favorite color right there. That little, that little teal scion. Next, it's a fight from Castlevania. Never yes, watched sir. it. Never watched it. Hey, this, this, this might make me get into it. Hey, mm. I love the camera pan. Castlevania is an American production, but it looks very anime, right? And right. it has a source material that's Japanese, so I guess it, it counts. Hey now, I've talked about Chinese anime on this channel before, so it's only fair to include something from the West now, isn't it? But seriously though, do we really care too much about West? technicalities when we have one hell of a fight between Trevor Belmont and Death? The fight has no shortage of epic moments nah, that, that crazy. capture the adrenaline of playing the original games. The United States the need to get it together, the they can make some nice little... The captures really hammer home Ooh. the impact of jumping around while fighting Death himself. Oh the dramatic comeback by Belmont is one of my favorite moments in the whole Castlevania series. It's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. Probably something that would make you want to check out Castlevania, right? Right. Well, it's a far cry from the traditional definitions of Sakura. That is crazy. In the context of the production, Ooh. this is a damn good fight. Oh, that's that My Hero Academia when that when that gets the peeling off. Is the, 
the clothes. This look great. Now I need to know. Yeah, tell me what's this. Boy, look, y'all ain't got my phone. I'll take a picture of that right now. I don't it's know been where my a phone while, at. But I think it's the perfect time to talk about this fight again. After all, for those of you who are mm. new to the channel, it's probably your first time being introduced to this masterpiece in animation. Nah, One of the for best real, though. fight scenes in anime if we're solely talking about the amount of effort exerted in animating a sequence so smoothly. I'm trying to just pay attention to this. This is for just crazy. I think that a key in keeping oh! your viewers engaged is to just wow them with smooth animation. And wow us, this show did with its display of superb martial arts and hand-to-hand -hand combat. Nah, for Unfortunately, real, though. the show's not too popular. And for the casual viewer the fight unfortunately may not mean too much so is the rest of the show not that's see that's what i was thinking like there ain't no other like fights from that show so it's like i ain't know if it was a good show or not jjk this JJK, fight is crazy where do we start to help damper the unfortunate news about the man i don't know recently, what you're doing if you ain't watched this show yet many many breathtaking action sequences Cleve, that the show you, has you better, to offer. You better have honestly speaking on there's a lot to pick from and i'm not even sure which one to feature for my list but after much deliberation i decided to go for the yuji and toto unique. fight that's very unique Hanami. why well it's simple. This fight for me is probably the fastest paced fight that requires so much more animation prowess to pull off. The characters go at it from the start and you Jujutsu can just get Kaisen lost the amount budget. of fluid movement that attacks your eyes. It helps that the fight has a lot of ways to keep you engaged, mostly through the techniques being put on display. You've got to watch this fight. No, it's no yeah, question it's that the animation will blow you away, but the application of teamwork and various techniques used in synergy is also a sight to see. I also like how Yuji and Todo didn't win the fight technically. They had to stall and survive long enough for Gojo to arrive and do his thing. Oh and that, my goodness. friends, is yet another visual spectacle to end the awesomeness of the whole thing. Nah, yeah, if you talk about Gojo, you might as well put this higher on the list. Okay, this makes sense. For me, I gotta see what's the rest of the rest. I gotta see what else is on here. If I can guess, Fate might be number one, bro. Fate is, just... is on a roll. Not only is his appearance in Fate Dragon be doing Ball a lot, Super, bro. It's really not fair when it comes to that Fate. Like, spine chilling transformation. More on that in this other video. His fight ooh, against Gogeta is, is one for the ages. That Thanks was to the wonders right of modern there. technology, the Broly and the Gogeta that we've known from the old days have been reborn in amazing fashion. Yeah. As expected from a theatrical production, the animation is just top notch, and it really captures so the heat times, of the battle bro. between just, two of the most powerful never beings in the Dragon Ball universe. Both fans of the old days looking nah, for nostalgia, really like CGI, the new like reviewers this, that DBS got would just love this Dragon fight. Super, Paying so. to see the movie live will forever be a purchase that I will never, ever regret. We right. rarely see Gogeta in action, see but he never disappoints when he sets out to kick ass. This is just one of the many fights that we'll remember the look series Look how that for. look. Like, just make me want to do it at this age. Look at the eye, look at the eye glare. Look, 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 look. You got to show it. Look how scared he looked. That's Broly. He finally looks scared. Nah, he kind of did look scared earlier in the, in the movie. Mmm, this made it to number five? With a fight that has a foregone conclusion, there are yeah. a few things you can do to make it interesting. The biggest and easiest way, in my opinion, is to have the whole thing look so over the top to the point where the audiences will remember it for years Ladies to and come. gentlemen. That, my friends, is how I'll evaluate you has Saitama versus Boros. <laughs> we all know Saitama is going to win this one up. anyway, so the question is a matter of how is he going to win? How is it going to look? Well, if right. attacks as over the top as the ones Boros threw is your thing, you've come to the right place. Watching the fight again, that is I can beautiful. almost feel the impact from Boros's attacks. That is beautiful. Attacks That's movie that animation right here. Attacks capable of planetary destruction. In the end, Boros's trump card is no match for Saitama's serious punch. He ain't even showing. We put an end to this chapter of One Punch Man in probably the most visually impactful way possible. Boros kicked him to the moon, bruh. Like what you oh yeah yeah number four oh that's tough number four yeah you yeah, think yeah. That just because i mentioned episode 19 in the intro we won't be having any demon slayer well especially he was since giving the all hands movie to some just got swords, released not too bro. long ago bringing with it the fight animations and effects that we've long known ufo table for no that's yes, crazy that's right we have akaza versus ufo rengoku table? as our is fourth it, place entry for the list for a good reason it's more than five minutes of simple oh. non-stop action featuring the techniques and the art style that have long become demon slayer signatures only now being available on the big screen, you can see how much better everything looks. I bought this For those movie. who haven't read the manga, the fight also came at an opportune time. Just when you thought that everything's over, here comes this far more powerful demon mm. who pushes the fire Hashira Bro. way beyond his limits. It's a fight filled to the brim with I emotion and stakes, and the fight is the one that leads to the tear-filled conclusion of the movie. It's one of the most moving fights in anime movie history for me.
Mm. Oh, I could do with some sword fights. Yes, sir. Oh, look at that hair. Oh. Oh, stop, 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 stop. We've got more theatrical productions coming up, and this is a fight that I've spent quite a lot of time talking about. Bro. Hey, I can't help it because it's really that good. No, We're this talking is crazy. about the climax of Sword of the Stranger. To be fair, most of the movie's fight scenes can qualify, as you can see with that early sequence that, of Luo Lang oh solo in those poor falls. However, I got a lot more into it when the time for the final battle came. Sword of the Stranger stands out for the other titles on this list because it's one of the titles that doesn't involve those supernatural Look at this, powers bro. or whatnot. Just good old swordsmanship. And it's fights like these that must be so well animated oh in order to captivate the audience. Luo Lang versus that. Nanashi that it just, almost single-handedly makes the movie like worth watching. But I'd say that the entire movie is good, not just this part. Still though, it's the standout that I'll always remember the film for. What am I doing? Like I know about this fight and I know about this movie and I, I ain't gonna lie. I still ain't watching it. I still ain't watching it. Now, I kind of didn't want to watch this fight in full effect because I didn't almost keep up so with this show. But I kind of watched a lot of this fight. Man. This fight is crazy. Bro. This fight is crazy. Boy, they, boy, they, the good old days, boy, huh? they did Seeing something Naruto with this. And Sasuke fight together brings they put back every some dollar memories. into this. And this is the one moment that the creators just cannot afford to screw up in Boruto. Thankfully, nah, they passed real. the test with flying colors and gave us this visual spectacle oh my of a goodness, fight. I love it's really lightning. a pleasure to see some callbacks to the old abilities that have become some of the most iconic parts of the franchise. Of course, it's made even better no, with no, no, the updated no. real visuals. Quick, real and quick. The Side note, you know who finna had like the best fights coming up? Like in the future, like the next year or two, even three, bro. Izuku Midoriya from My Hero Academia is finna have some, even Bakugo. I mean, all of them for real, for real, but Midoriya is just finna have the drippiest Very fight scenes, some fight scenes of, of all time, bro. Like, I, just, I, I was at wait, the edge bro. of my seat when I first saw this fight, and it felt like a reunion filled with suspense and tension. The fight is good and all, but I think the saddest part of this is how much it reminds us of good old Naruto. And given how much effort got put into this fight mm. and how beautiful it looked, I'd like to think bro. that the animators are kind of in the same boat. Nah, yeah. Oh my goodness. At the top of the list is none other than I just you watched guessed this. it, Saber versus Ryder I Ishiro. just watched this. Nah, this is wild. This oh, how could we have a list chill, of breathtaking fight sequences without Ew, featuring look probably at me like the that, holy bro. grail of big screen productions in that regard? The Heaven's Field trilogy Ooh, has been nothing wee. short of breathtaking with its animation on the fight sequences, and the third movie gave be doing us the all pinnacle of, this, of it all. The Saber versus Ryder and Shiro fight is something that I've been so excited to see when I started following the series. Then the trailer hit. Bro, then the actual chill. film I just hit, said, and let's bro. just say that I was completely captivated by the glorious animation in the real thing. Then, I won't that's go as color. far that's as to say that nothing him. will compare to this fight in the film trilogy, but it's got a pretty damn secure grip on the top spot for me. There could be some arguments for some right. to consider the Berserker versus Saber fight, and it's a valid point, but for me, I think there's just far more stakes and emotional investment in this fight, and we know that it's the magic ingredient to help push a fight further. And with that in right. mind, I put this as my number one breathtaking battle in anime, and I'm curious if you'd agree or not. Feel free to chime in on the comment section while you're at it. Look at this, bro. Oh my god. That Chill. brings us to the end of this list. Chill. If you enjoyed Woo, she got they gotta stop. They gotta stop with that, bro. I, the eyes, bro. Them eyes got more budget than a couple shows I just seen. But anyway, that's beside the point, man. If you enjoyed the video, if you made it this far, I appreciate you. Leave a like, comment, share the video if you know what I'm saying. Comment some, comment some, you know, some ideas. What, what, what you want me to react to? You feel me? But with that being said, man, it's about four in the morning. Man. I'm all y'all. Uh,